Hello friends, hope you are doing good. So in this tutorial, I'm going to introduce an Excel data entry automation tool. Uh, there is a lots of essential features. I'm opening this. So I'm going to show all our features step by step. So there is a click button to open the user form. And this is our all required fields. So this is our drop down list. So sometimes we need to some of information uh, need to input in the drop down list, but uh, there are some missing. Are uh, if some input fields are missing, then we need to input there. So if we input this, then what will be happened? Uh, then I am just uh, input this, and the second input field will be fill up, and this is also, and this is also the yes or no option so i am using as a yes and yes and this is also the drop down list so i am manually type this uh, you can say this is drop down list but this information is not fine in our drop down list so that's why i am typing this manually so this is also the another option is try so so you can see this is all our information is fill up but uh, this information is not find out in our drop list. After all, we are using our required information is inputting. And after completing all the information, you need to click add new and you need to, and data is inputting there. So, the next option is you can see before that we are using some of information is input there, like we are using life, uh, we are using test, and also we are using their type. So, this is this information is yeah, so when you input in the drop down list by value manually then information is added to the uh, your database also the information uh, extra input need in the uh, in the drop down list we can understand uh, that this is our support sheet for all the drop down list like when you input anything then the drop down list will show this from this required column and if anything is missing then that will be insert there so this is should be unique so uh, and and you open this form so there is also a search criteria you can see there is a multiple search criteria is available now if you want to like search anything by using date then there is start date and end date and you can search by start date is 19 october and in date is 19 October. So the search value will be show. But sometimes we need to the multiple criteria wise data. So I need to show the life range and there as you can see LRE. And I'm using the search button. So this is a, our required data. You can see the, our already we search by life range. So uh, we cannot again search by life range and we need to search criteria add another so we can add like this and if you use no then there is no any data that means there are two types of criteria first criteria and first search value and this is the second criteria and this is the second search value so all our combination will be matched then the required data will be show and you can uh, double click here if you want to edit anything then the, then you need to double click here and record all information will be show there and you can update anything and after update anything after completing the update end then you can select the update button to update information and if you want to delete the information then you need to the double click again and that is uh, delete button and click the delete button to delete all information and there is also the clear button to clear all the information. So there is the refresh button to full information, full user from will be refreshed. And this is the download. download. Uh, sometimes we need to the search anything and uh, we need to the multiple types wise search. After searching, we need to download them. You can download the data by using the download button. So I am using this. So data is downloading in the our local PC. So I am opening this and this is our required data. So I am going to close it and if we reopen our user form and there is the all our open on the course to show the Excel sheet. 
and after complete all the execution you need to exit it so do you want to leave okay yes and this workbook will be closed so there is so there is you can see a support sheet as by this by this sheet you can edit all the top down list okay that's all for the excel uh, the home data entry i show further all the steps by steps coding then you can understand how we can develop it so as usual you can see this is our downloadable portal all our automation tool will be day by day updated there and you can download as per your required and you can also buy me a coffee as usual please subscribe to my channel that's all thank you very much see you in the next automation tool